ocupada para estas persecuciones, Bancho. Ya no es una niña. Tiene un pueblo que cuidar. Solo no quieres que persiga fantasmas. I love old maps. When I was a little girl, they always led to treasure. <laughs> Siempre me hacen sentir más perdida. My name's Lara, by the way. Pilar. No pareces el tipo de turista que solemos tener. I'm an archaeologist, actually. Ay, sí, creo que sería más apropiado. Deberías hablar con Abigail. Ella conoce la historia de este lugar mejor que nadie. We've already met. Abby's been kind enough to let my friend and I stay with her while we're visiting. Ah, bueno, entonces eres un huésped bienvenido en Kuwakyaku. Thank you. Do you need help understanding the map? <laughs> no era para que yo lo entendiera. I have hidden the truth, as Abigail will find, but to uncover it, she must take a trip back in time. <laughs> Mariana nunca fue una gran poetisa. Mariana. La abuela de Abigail. La perdimos contra el cáncer. Hoy hace un año en realidad. I'm sorry to hear that. Mariana quería que Abigail tuviera el mapa en el aniversario de su muerte. Pero... Yo no sé. No sé si está lista. It's none of my business, but if it helps, Mariana believes she was. Tienes razón. Supongo que nunca fue mi decisión, ¿verdad? ¿Te importaría entregarle el mapa a Abigail? Perseguir a esa chica es trabajo de tiempo completo. Y mis caderas no lo soportan. Not at all. Claro. Abby, it's Lara. Hey, stranger. How are you making out? How's Jonah? Jonah's fine. He's with a friend. <laughs> a friend, huh? What's her name? <laughs> His name is Uchu. Listen, Abby, I'm back in Kwakiaku, and I've come across an old map that belonged to your grandmother. Well, there's an old timer in town, Diego. He runs the community garden. He's in two maps, I think. Maybe he can take a look. Meet me there? On my way. ¿La puedo ayudar? I'm a friend of Abby's. She asked me to meet her here. We have a map we'd like you to look at. Ah, huh? echemos un vistazo. Mm. Este es un buen trabajo. Buen detalle. Me alegra ver que se ha retrasado todos estos años. You're familiar with it. Puede que haya un poco más de polvo en el ático en estos días, pero nunca olvido mi trabajo. La abuela de Abby me pidió que lo preparara. Recuerdo bien, se suponía que era algún tipo de regalo para Abby. There are blemishes here, three of them, do you see? Hmm. Yo no los puse ahí. <laughs> Huele a limón, ¿no? Lemon. Lamenta. There could be a heat fix message hidden in the map. Can I use your brazier? Seguro, adelante. ¿Cómo funciona esto? Well, lemon juice is organic, so it will oxidize and turn brown when it's heated, and a secret message will appear. Han pasado muchos años. ¿Crees que todavía se notará? As soon as Abby gets here, we're gonna find out. Find out what? Y mira quién llegó. <laughs> I'm an angel, Diego. You know that. <laughs> no cuando eras pequeña. <laughs> Abby, according to Diego, your grandmother asked him to make the map for you, as a gift. Why would I need a map of the village? I know this place in my sleep. There's more. 
Your grandmother hid something here in the paper. You can barely see it. I think it's a secret message. Uso tinta invisible. Invisible ink. Really? Bueno, solo es jugo de limón, pero... But it does the trick. So, what's this secret? Don't know. May I? Let's take a look. Look, those symbols, they're... Three X's. X marks the spot. <laughs> Cute, Grandma. Are these points far from here? Nope. Should we split up? Sure. I'll take those two there. Thanks. Impossible. I can't carry any more.
There's a three-stepped edge on one side that looks to have been carved by hand. How are you making out? Almost at it. Whatever it is. You? Look for a fragment of stone with a three-stepped edge. I found one here. I'm sure we're looking for two others. You're the expert. Hand carved on one side, broken on the other, definitely part of something larger. It's almost familiar, but I wonder. There's a three-stepped edge on one side that looks to have been carved by hand. Interesting. The other edge is roughly broken, like it's been shattered. This is only a piece of something larger. Lara, I think I have one of those stone things here. I've got the others. Now what? Now we put them together and see what your grandmother is trying to tell you. Bilad understood Grandma better than anyone. Meet me at her place. Que Abigail estuviera contigo. She's on her way. Hi, Auntie. Ah, ha pasado mucho tiempo, niña. Déjame verte. Todavía con el cabello corto, ya veo. Auntie, we found something in Grandma's map. En realidad, tu cabello también podría estar mejor ahora que te veo de nuevo. Par de niñas tan poco femeninas. Auntie, please. Why did Grandma want me to have the map? I deserve to know. ¿Recuerdas las historias que tu abuela solía contarte cuando eras niña? Sobre un lugar mágico, escondido, construido por tus antepasados. Yes, but I grew up, and she grew old, and nothing magical ever happened. Ah, pero no olvidó su promesa. Está ahí, en tus manos. Why now? Ah. Soy la guardiana del mapa. Depende de ti descubrir su propósito. 
Abby, I'm sure whatever is revealed in this map will lead to that hidden place and your answers. I hope so. All right, let's take a look. The Chakana, the Inca Cross, it represents the three levels of existence. The upper world, the middle world, our world, and the underworld. También representa las cosas que nos han manos. Capacidad de amar, de actuar, de ganar sabiduría. But if I'm remembering correctly, the center of the Chakana is said to represent Cusco, the capital of the Inca Empire. In the context of the map, we're hundreds of miles from there. Hay muchas interpretaciones, Chacana. Cusco. Um, un portal de un mundo a otro. También se dice que es el ojo de Dios, un guardián que vela por todos nosotros. So, what are we looking for? I mean, this has to point to something, right? Let's take a closer look. There has to be something we're not seeing. Something... There! I thought it was a small blemish when I first saw it, but in this light, it looks like a Maya hieroglyph. Maya? That doesn't make any sense. We are Inca. What does it say? Hahil. It means truth. Truth? Truth about what? I don't know. Does this on the map mean anything to you? Grandma and I would sit there when she told me stories about the hidden place. Hmm, tal vez encuentres tus respuestas ahí. Are you ready? Keep the map. I'll meet you there. Keep your radios. I'll stay in touch if I find anything. Sounds good. And watch your ass in there. You can count on that. There must be a switch somewhere. This architecture is definitely Maya. Doesn't make any sense. What have you got? If I had to guess, I'd say this place is a massive forge. But on this scale, what would they be forging that would require this kind of heat? Thank <laughs> you. 
bridge must have a counterweight to raise it. There are statues here, huge faces arranged in a circle around the central column. They're watching over it like sentinels. But what are they guarding? These platforms you must have, have counterweights like the bridges. Now I kind of wish I came with you. Whoever was wearing this either had a splitting headache or they didn't leave at all. Wait, there's dried blood here. Platform should go back up. Per seismic imaging results, 25th of November, 1983. Massive oil fields beneath the village. I have conducted a physical examination of area and can confirm this to be the case. Recommend full drill operation. Paul Veneer will be back in the black. Village expendable. Recommend stage 01 outbreak if buyout ineffectual. We cannot allow the <sighs> change. The report.
the switch. I better activate it. The gas is on. Gas head must be activated as well. But the switch can't be reached from here. There's a sarcophagus here. It's beautiful. Definitely royal. Made it. A sarcophagus. Like a coffin. Exactly like a coffin. I thought it was a forge. Whoever is buried here, they were very closely tied to this place and its purpose. Encontraste el lugar escondido. It was a forge, but something more as well. <sighs> sí, es el lugar de descanso de la reina Maya Abarrane, la primera guardiana de Kuakyaku, que construyó la forja para construir un artefacto de gran poder. What artifact? Ah, no lo sé. Mariana me dijo que lo que había nacido en ese lugar se había perdido hace mucho tiempo, pero dijo que el mensaje que contenía siempre perduraría. Era un mensaje de esperanza para el futuro. If you knew about all this, why wouldn't you tell me? Lo siento, pero le hice una promesa a Mariana. So what? I'm supposed to accept that I'm Maya all of a sudden? El linaje de Abarrane se ha diluido a lo largo de los siglos, pero tú desciendes de ella. So what does this mean? Eres una guardiana, Abigail, como Mariana y su madre antes que ella, desde los tiempos de Abarrane. <laughs> I can't be a guardian. I have responsibilities here. I've... Has estado protegiendo este pueblo durante años. No lo supiste siempre. ¿Te has sentido obligada de alguna manera? Ahora eres la guardiana de la historia. That's what Grandma used to say. She said it was her job to keep its story. To keep it safe. She promised that one day she would show me where it was, and then I'd be the keeper of its story. No olvidó su promesa. Es una forma diferente de mostrarte. It's so like her, isn't it? She couldn't just tell me. 
had to make a treasure hunt out of it. <sighs> Amaba a tu abuela si fuera mi propia hermana, pero a veces era peor que un dolor de muelas. Abby, I think I'll leave you two alone to talk about things. Sounds like you've got some catching up to do. Thanks, Lara. Here, I want you to have this for all your help. And before you say anything, it's customary, so you kind of can't say no. Thank you.